Hey everyone, welcome to Positive Round Plays Death's Door. This is an action adventure game from Acid Nerve, who made Titan Souls, the, uh, the single arrow boss rush style game. Uh, published by Devolver Digital. This is uh, my own purchase, not a, not a sponsored thing or anything like that, but uh, looks really neat. It's kind of a, a Zelda ish action adventure about being a crow that it works in uh, the Souls department, I guess. But uh, yeah, thought I would play this. A little bit of a different style, instead of just uh, another Metroidvania. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love my 2D Metroidvanias, but let's go for a 3D one instead. Um, other than that, I don't know a whole heck of a lot it, about it. Some uh, some parallels to Dark Souls, of course, are made as they are with every game. Reaping Commission Headquarters. Ah, yes, the old RCH. Sharon, the bus driver. Thanks, Sharon. There we are. Oh, look at us. We're adorable. Now, oh, let's make a phone call. Oh. Seems like the phone isn't connected to anything. We. Okay. We can fall off of things. That is good information. <laughs> That is extremely good information. Uh, as always with new series and stuff, let me know how the audio is. I always try to balance it beforehand, but uh, always helps get a little bit of feedback. Uh, I did turn the uh, screen shake down a little bit too, because that uh, tends to tire out my eyeballs. Ain't got no souls. Ain't got no shinies. Ain't got no worries. I mean, seems like you're doing all right. Maybe you should come inside, though. I love that sign. Like the... the... <laughs> the skull ramen bowl. It's pretty great. Yeah, you're clear. Move it along, bud. Um... Wait a minute. Ball plart. Really? Really? Oh, all right. Call the doors. Better get moving. Don't want to be late, right? Uh, so one thing I do know about this game is that there is no map. So, uh... <laughs> God help us all, or whatever deity or non-deity you may believe in. So that looks like a, maybe a bombable wall of some sort. Well, well, well. Chandler the Handler. Look who showed up for work. No worms for you. I get it. It's a bird joke. Yeah, I, I got you, pal. It's your lucky day. I actually have a soul for you to reap. Not just any soul, a giant soul. Think of the commission on that. Like Dark Souls 2 style? Hope you haven't forgotten your training. Stay in your towns, giant souls don't often go peacefully. Dropping in your door for now. The soul that size might even be able to afford some time off, but remember... Your door will remain open until you return with your designated soul. While your door is open, you will be mortal and you will age, so get it done quickly. Reaping souls to power the door just so we can reap more souls and the cycle repeats forever. Rat race, eh? Anyway, get to it and be careful. You die, it's gonna be a lot of paperwork, and I just don't have the time. Interesting concept. Must be the boss here. Darwin the Vault Keeper. Oh no, just just the Vault Keeper. Oh boy, I love typing. Can't get enough of it. Agatha the Typist. Like Agatha Christie?
Nice little elevator there. Uh, that looks like an important potential gate of some sorts. What else we got over? Uh, is that what is down there? Is that behind that broken? It is. Oh, this this shiny stuff down there. I don't know if rolling is fat. Oh, what's this umbrella? Found a discarded umbrella. Just the thing to keep your feathers dry in grim weather. You can equip it from the weapons menu. Oh, really? How about that? We already got a new weapon. Uh, it seems to be... Bad? But it's adorable? Interesting. I wonder... That's, that's really curious. I wonder if that serves a purpose. Or maybe it's just supposed to be a challenge item? Maybe no. Do an umbrella run. Open on up. Whoa. Grove of Spirits, a science soul location. Yeah, we I've been rolling. Who are you? All right, some sort of switch. I'm sorry, little buddy. I didn't mean to spook you. You were following me. Not sure if that's good or bad. What about you? You want to follow too? All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's all go for a journey. Okay, so we hold left trigger to aim. We have a ranged attack here. Oh, they all kind of sprouted there for a second. Oh, oh geez. I did not mean to scare them all off, I'm sorry. Boy, they are everywhere. Now we don't have any sort of target line there, so I'm curious... Oh boy. Demonic Forest Spirit. Alright. Seems we're starting with an intro boss here. No contact damage, that's good to know. It looks like we regenerate... oh boy. Do we need to hit all of these maybe? Oh yeah, there we go. Yeah, it seems like we re regenerate... whoops. We regenerate... oh geez. Got it. Yeah, we regenerate ammo by melee attacking. Which is good to know. Um, excuse me. I believe that's my soul. Please don't take it.
Moss Cemetery. Well, this is certainly a thing that is happening to us. I think we got knocked out. I think someone took our soul. That isn't our actual soul, but the, the one we were trying to earn there. I also did not get a health restoration, which is moderately concerning. Who are you? It's a ladder there. Life seed. Planting one of these in a green pot will yield soul fruit, which can be consumed to restore your health. Handy. Especially since right now I don't see another way to, to do that. Looks like some enemies up there. Oh, are you friendly? No, you are not friendly. Or at least if you were, you certainly aren't now. Now, does this go back? Interesting. Little crow? Do I sense a glut of soul energy? Come here and you can train in those souls to gain an edge in combat. Ah, here we go. Here's our upgrade system. Oh, and we did get refilled too when we came back here. I'm gonna guess that probably respawns things though. Uh, first of all... Badger the Reaper, you lost your assignment. It's rough, buddy. It's been so quiet the past few years. Advances medicine or anything or something. I expect. So annoying. I need a new plague. I'm gonna go broke. Did I check this area before? Hmm. You lost your assigned soul. It's the one thing we didn't want to happen. You beautiful, careless sunflower. Looks like you made quite a mess of things that last assignment. Don't worry, I'll sort the paperwork out for you is going to require supplementary forms. My lucky day. Welcome to the Soul Vaults. Would you like to increase your combat abilities? Yes. All right, so we got strength, dexterity, haste, and magic. Uh, we can't afford any of this. Strength increases melee weapons and reach. Dexterity is uh, charge melee and range faster. And chain speed. Haste is movement speed, faster dodges, less cooldown time between dodges. That seems incredibly important. Uh, magic increases magic powers. Let's go back out and we'll explore a little more before we wrap up the first episode. Hey, what's that? Massive soul energy. That was just a straight up 100 souls. That's a very suspicious area. It's another life seed. Now I have heard that uh, life restoration stuff in this game is incredibly scarce. So we'll probably sit on these life seeds for a little bit. Huh. Locks. Okay, so locks are enemies to defeat in this case. Seems like enemies get a little bit of uh, stagger and knockback as well. Now there is... I don't know if we want to plant a seed here. 
All right, well, off to a bad start. I think we get a, a charge back with every hit. Some sort of key, I think. Oh yeah, I do see the icon in the, uh, the upper left there. But it's not for this. Hmm. This way to the summit. Well, can't get there yet, it seems. Enemies certainly don't give a lot of souls to start either, it looks like. The heck are you? Seems like a combat arena of sorts. I don't think I can charge... Oh, okay, yes I can. I just don't think they've taught me that yet. So if I hold right trigger, I can charge my melee attack. Which is good to know. Now I don't have a real indication of how much damage we do. But it seems like it's probably pretty powerful. It's a little tough to, to line up. Yeah, I think I had just one shot that guy. All right, no problem. Got a decent chunk of uh, souls off that too. Well, we can look around with uh, right stick. Well, that was just mildly disorienting there for a second. Must need some sort of switch to open that. Who are you? S Steadhone the Gravedigger. Ah, Reaper. My time in this world is over. Oh? Oh. Unfortunately, I am still alive. I tried. Sorry, maybe if you try hitting me with a harder attack? I mean... I kind of feel bad, honestly. Oh, are we gonna dump him in here? <sighs> Alright. No, still here and still very much alive. Perhaps try a bit of a run-up. Oh, interesting. Sorry, it's not your fault. It happens to everyone. I'm afraid I am burdened with unending life. Can't explain it. I've spent untold years seeking an answer. My name is Sidhone. I'm Keeper of the Graves on this sacred mountain. If you find yourself strengthened somehow, feel free to try and kill me again. Interesting. Here lies the guardian of the door, preserver of order, and home to stray souls. We can't shoot that, can we? No. Can we loop around to the... Yeah! That attack's a little weird to execute because it's the, the charge attack button.
Yeah, I don't know totally how life seeds work. I'm, I'm curious, is it a illusion of Gaia herb situation? Like, we're only going to get a few, and then that's it? I'm guessing, because we're planting them, that they'll be a replenishable resource of some sorts. Alright, that's a shortcut of some sort. Ooh, it, it turns the- look at that! Little hidden area back here? There's a shrine. I didn't think it would ever turn the camera like that. The ancient shrines offers you a shard from a vitality crystal. Collecting four will raise your vitality beyond its limit. So this is our uh, heart pieces. Very cool. Can we see that in our inventory somewhere? Yeah. Magic crystal shards. Can't open that though. Ooh. Got got good there. can find another door in the next little bit here. That's another, another life seed. Where the heck am I? Alright, that's a ominous door. Okay, we can't, that's like a one-way path. any sort of like plunging attack we can got a little greedy there well you know what this would be a good time to test this out hmm but it doesn't uh it doesn't like disappear gauntlet section here. You know what? I was like, it's probably a bad idea. But I never learn, do I? Well, that's... That's dangerous. Oh, I actually stopped him from charging there. There's still more. Still more. Damn, I I had a feeling. Death. Well what happens? This is a good this is a good way to to pause here. We don't lose anything. I guess just uh Momentum. <laughs> we might as well grab, uh, grab an upgrade here. Mm. 
Yes. I, I mean, that does look marginally bigger. Right, I think this is a good place to pause. We'll continue next time. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did click like, it helps a bunch. Subscribe for more. I'll see you soon.